Celine Dion is opening up about about her fashion choices after she made an emotional appearance at the 2024 Grammys, during a recent interview with Vogue for their Life in Looks series on YouTube. The Canadian pop star, 56, looked back at her style over the years and opened up about the mustard yellow Valentino coat she wore to the award ceremony. It was very nerve wracking, but at the same time, a big honor, she told the outlet of her surprise appearance at the Grammys in February. That magic. That excitement. To see the fans, to see the crowd. To see show business again. For the five time Grammy winner, who was styled by celebrity stylist Law Roach for the evening, the coat, served an emotional purpose in addition to a stylish one, Dion told Vogue that she felt better having something to hold on to while she stepped out on stage. I was like, you can walk on stage with a coat. Oh yeah. You can do whatever you want in fashion, have a good time, wear that coat, own that coat, go for it, she recalled. And it made me feel better for a moment to hold on to this coat, to hide myself a little bit from all these little things. The singer then broke into song singing the words from her 2019 track Imperfections, dot. I got my own imperfections. I got my own, I got my own, whole. She sang in the video, before going to her interview. So, we did it. Her time on stage at the ceremony is one of just a few public appearances Dion has made over the last few years, after she was diagnosed with the rare and incurable neurological disorder Stiff Person Syndrome, SPS, in 2022. She stepped out at the Crypto.com Arena in Los Angeles to present Album of the Year, an award she first won 27 years ago, with her son, Rene Charles Angelo, 23, accompanying her to a standing ovation from the star-filled crowd. It took a lot, a lot out of me. But my son, Rene Charles, R.C., came and gave me his support. And to present the award, the Album of the Year, to Taylor Swift. It was an honor because she's having the time of her life and I'm the one who's presenting it to her, Dion added. But it's always very, very touching when you have a standing ovation.